Alright, welcome back to another edition of JTV. Today I'm going to show you how to use Onyx VJ to create some neat effects like you see here with the billboards. Uh, the first thing you're going to need is some pictures of the billboards or whatever you want to use. And then of course you're also going to use Onyx VJ for that. Um, as you can see right now, I've got a video playing over here on this side and then my webcam over here and behind it I have an image and if I turn off the videos you can see it's just a plain image back there that I've put my webcam and the other video over now to get the effect go and switch the full screen here so you can see everything that I'm doing to get the actual effect what we've done is we have our webcam in one layer and our video in another layer and then behind both of them we have the picture of our billboard I've got a, another one here that I'll show you in a little bit close that one out and what I've done is I've applied the distort filter to it which you can go to bitmap effects and then down to distort and then just drag that up we'll go ahead and put the videos back to normal and all I did, we're going to close this video out as well. And all I had to do was just come down here to the effects settings and just drag them down. And since I'm recording the whole screen here, this is going to be a little slower, but that's okay. And then you just line the corners up with the corners of the billboard to all four corners. and that'll kind of give you your perspective alright and there we go now we're back up on the billboard and our other one is blank now let's go ahead and grab the other billboard and I'll show you how to mix several videos together we'll just drag this up here and replace this one now this one has three different squares on it which you can see better if I move my camera out of the way it has three different squares on it now what we're going to do is we're going to use the same process and we're going to fill that in with three different videos. We'll go ahead and go back to just the screen here. Actually we'll follow cursor so you can see what I'm doing a little bit quicker. First thing I want to do is I want to add in a couple of videos. I'm going to go ahead and use this video and we're going to use, well, let's go ahead and use this one and then we'll go ahead and put our webcam in there as well. Now to line them up I'm going to have to disable these layers from being shown for a minute. And I come over here and I grab my distort filter and then I'm going to move the corners to where I want it. I want to go ahead and make this one of the little squares. And we'll just position the corners roughly right now. And there's what we have so far. You can see the video up there. And that's our original video. Now let's go ahead and do this one here. So we're going to turn it back on again. So it shows up in our preview. And we're going to drag our distort back up again and we're going to grab another corner and we're going to do this one right underneath the other one and don't worry if it looks a little weird while you're moving the corners around because once you get them set in place everything will kind of go back to normal All right let's move the top one just a little bit the other one so there's our original video and there's what we've got on our billboard. Now let's go ahead and do the camera. We'll enable it. As you can see, I've got it on my head, and you can tell I don't have them lined up quite right, but that's okay. Grab our distort filter once more. And then we'll start moving the corners into place. Alright, and sometimes you might find that it's easier to work with 
certain corners first so you can see what's going on. All right, there's my video. And it's not perfect, but I can see that I've got three videos playing inside my billboard. And I can actually turn them on and off using my shortcut keys. So that's just one more thing that you can do with Onyx VJ. If you have any questions about the video, feel free to comment or ask. You can also stop by jcrash.net and leave a comment there on my video section, and I'll get back to you. Thanks for watching.